Okay, so we're going to have a bit more of a look at the Sony Ericsson Xperia Arc, and you can see here that it's right next to the uh, HTC Desire S. Now, a lot of you have been mentioning the speed, so what we're going to do is use um, a benchmark tool on both of these phones, and we're going to set them off at the same time, hopefully, if I can get this done right. And we're going to use Quadrant to run a benchmark test on both phones at the same time. So here's Quadrant, fire that up. You can see the screen difference here, by the way, while I'm doing this, because uh, the screen on the right, there's less um, mistiness about it. It's very clear. It's just like the screen, you're touching the actual screen and not a piece of glass in front of it. So I'm going to press run full benchmark, one, two, three, at the same time. And here you go. And you can see it's running the full benchmark on both phones. I'll try and get rid of some of this uh, sunlight that you can see in the background here. And we're already on to the next part of the test on the Sony Ericsson Xperia Arc. Desire S is just doing, lagging a little behind it. You can see it's doing the graphic test here as well and it does the frames per second at the bottom here. And we'll see which one's the winner. And you can see here that the Sony Ericsson appears to have achieved the top score here of 1572. And you can see how that compares to the Nexus One, the Droid X, and the Evo. And on the left here, the Desire S. Still pretty good with a score of 1263. So I just wanted to really show you a bit about that. Now let's have a look at some other bits and bobs. I'll just get the phone up here because there's a lot of uh, daylight reflection. I'm going to have to cut this video short because I've just been told by my camcorder here that I'm running out of space. So um, we'll come back and we'll do another demo later on. But uh, until then, uh, that's just a quick look at how fast the Sony Ericsson Xperia Arc is. Very nice phone, by the way. I, I am liking this. Very big phone and um, very thin. Very nice handset.